just leaving the Starbucks. Really good internet, very fast. I'm happy about that. Really good fast internet is really good for me. We don't have to spend all day at Starbucks. We can get back on the road really quick, keep on exploring new stuff. So I'm happy about that. And it's still early, it's only 8.30. I was only there for like an hour. Uh, so we're gonna head towards Fresno today. So let's get going. Wow, it's hot, man. We just got here in Fresno. It's hot here. Yeah, we're definitely in. Right now it's 90 degrees outside. That's hot. After being on the coast for like 60s and 70s and then coming up to here, 90 degrees, it's definitely hot. <laughs> but I don't know if you can see, but I got something new for storage. Well, I guess another one for storage. Yeah, but we're just gonna quick stop here at the Walmart, grab some supplies that we couldn't get yesterday and keep on going. Uh, yeah, on the way out of town, there's a gym, so that's perfect. I'll, one more, I'll work out one more time, take one more shower before we start heading towards Kings Canyon and I'll be happy. Yeah, I'll be fine with that. So I'll see you guys probably uh, after the gym in a couple hours. Yeah, so I don't think I'm doing anything too exciting between then, besides you know, going and get groceries for a few days, you know. Oh, we have a chair. Well, why do we have this chair? Well, to sit down, really. But uh, I'm thinking right now, such a nice day out. We got the uh, little river right here behind us. And I'm thinking, Let's cut my hair. I've always wanted to try to cut my own hair, see how it would turn out. So let's try to cut my own hair. We gotta go back over by the Jeep so we can use the power inverter, but let's see how it turns out. I mean, I don't think it's gonna be that hard. I just kinda get the side. Yeah, you get the idea. Let's try to cut my hair. All right, let's do it. This is either going to be one of the best things I've ever done or one of the worst things I've ever done. If it really goes good, like I'm hoping it should, then we'll probably do this a lot more often. Or every time we need a haircut, we'll just cut our own hair. But if it goes bad, then we're probably not going to cut our hair again. So let's just try it and see what happens. All right, here we go. What do you think? Not too bad, huh? Debating on if I should go shorter up top or not. Hmm. I don't know, I like it. I definitely thought that was be a, gonna be a lot harder. The only really hard part was the back. I don't know. Let me know how it looks. I think I messed it up. Let me know how that looks. I think I really messed up the rear, but the front and the sides look pretty decent. So I'm gonna say that's a win. I'm gonna go jump in the water, get all this hair off of me, and we'll find something to do tonight.
We're up on top of the Jeep because we got a new or another freaking sports tub or you know like a storage unit for me that we're gonna put up on top of the Jeep. I'm gonna figure out how I wanna mount it and pretty much what I did wanted to do first off was this black one just be, well first off I ordered two of these black ones off Amazon. And um, I wanted one to be just tools, and then the other one to be like, you know, like blankets and cold weather or like seasonal clothes we could wear. But uh, yeah, so now we have another one we just picked up yesterday or earlier today in Fresno. And we're gonna figure out how, where we wanna put these guys and how we're gonna set them set them up. So let's get to it. I'm gonna make the black one just tools and then the green one, which we just got, we're gonna make that one, uh, you know, blankets and you know, just extra stuff we don't need to have inside the Jeep. So let's get to it. Okay, I figured I'd show you guys before it gets too late, but what I got in the bins here. So this one right here is pretty much just like extra blankets, uh, sweaters. I got my fishing stuff down there, you know, random stuff. I got a snorkel. Like uh, I got this really cool, awesome hat when it gets cold, you know, gloves, warm socks, flip flops, and then my laundry stuff in here. And then that one's pretty much all tools, recovery gear, extra parts, you know. So that one's got all that in it. But yeah, yeah, that's pretty much what's gonna go in these things. Uh, it's gonna get dark here pretty soon, but that's the new storage setup. So let's strap it all on and see how it looks. There it is all tucked away and stored up. I think this looks, let me do a little walk around first before I start talking about it. Okay, those are all done. I think they look great. Even though they're not the same color, I love the green. Green's my favorite color, so that's that. And um, it just looks more uniform, the Jeep, than having just the one sideways on the back. It kind of looked weird. Um, having two of them, both facing like straight, I think it looks much better. The gas can still fit, but it'd be a lot nicer to have a, uh, a metal gas can, you know, a jerry can. Like if I don't use the gas up in the gas can, it evaporates because I poked a hole on the very top of the gas can for like a breather so the gas can flow better. But if I don't use the gas very quickly, it, um, it evaporates. Like not all the gas, probably like a gallon or two, just depending on how long I don't use it for. But that's gonna work for now. So that's the new storage setup. Tools, tools on the black one, uh, clothes, blankets, random stuff in the green one. So that's that. And yeah, I'm probably staying here for tonight and maybe tomorrow. Yeah, depending on if I get kicked out of here or not. We'll see. Uh, I don't really know if I'm allowed to stay here. There was no, there was no signs that said no camping. So I'm assuming I'm allowed to stay here. But who knows? This is more like a fishing area. It's like a table for like a day use. But either way, I'm probably gonna stay here for tonight. Uh, I'm just gonna make up some dinner. 
and hang out, watch the watch the river flow by. This current is really strong. But for now, thanks for watching guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow and thanks for hanging out with me today. See ya.